Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Alright, so for today, we'll be doing something different whereby I'm going to unbox and review for you guys my brand new Adidas Ultra Boost sneakers. Now, what's so special about this sneaker is that this is a limited edition release by Adidas and they collaborated with the new James Bond film titled No Time to Die. I personally think that it looks really, really cool and I think you guys might like it as well. Now, without further ado, let's check it out. Okay guys, so now let's get this thing unboxed. So as you guys can see, we have that gun barrel sequence at the front here and on the inside, we have the 007 right here and also the Adidas logo on top here. Now, if you guys were to look closely, the inner part of this cover, we have the blueprints uh, of the uh, Safin bunker, which is uh, Safin is actually the villain in this uh, new James Bond film, which was played by Rami Malik. And on the inner part right here, uh, they saw like a grey concrete finish, which is to capture the essence of Safin's concrete bunker as well. And I think that's pretty cool. Okay guys, so now let's take a look at the shoe inside. Okay, so this is how you guys open it up. Oh, okay guys, take a look at that. This right here is the Adidas Ultra Boost X James Bond No Time To Die. I think that this is actually a really beautiful sneaker and it looks really really clean and I'm loving the design guys. Look at that. The colorway is just uh, absolutely beautiful and it reminds me so much of the Safin character. Now Adidas released another two different colorways for this uh, James Bond edition and for me, the other two felt like it looks just like a normal pair of Adidas sneakers. You know, it doesn't really look that special to me. Unlike this one, we have this really cool uh, white color for this lace cover right here and this right here is actually for them to recreate uh, the porcelain face that Rami Malik's character was wearing in the film and as you guys can see the colorway for this uh, sneaker is mainly grey in color now grey color is actually to resemble uh, the color of Safin's bunker in the film which was made out of concrete so concrete is uh, great in color now I didn't know what this was at first but when I searched for it online they mentioned that this right here is actually the aerial view of the poison garden on the island that James Bond visit and when it comes to Adidas we have the usual continental uh, soles right here and if you guys look closely here this right here is actually the ultra boost torsion bar and the design is actually to resemble the mysterious fluid uh, that can be seen in the film and on the inner sole, again, we have that Adidas and 007 logo at the bottom. And on top there, we have, when you combine it, you can see the blueprints of Safin's bunker as well. So yeah, there's a lot of James Bond elements that can be seen in this sneaker. Okay guys, so now let's test these babies out. Jump. Now when it comes to Adidas Ultra Boost punya kasut ni kan dia punya tapak dia tu rasa sangat selesa and dia macam sangat-sangat lembut tau and the idea is actually to give you guys the extra energy or the extra boost uh, that you guys need when you guys are running ataupun masa jalan-jalan and you guys will have no issues whatsoever using this for long hours and another thing that I want to talk about is that when it comes to Adidas collaborations the themes that they're going for is actually very subtle and not really in your face sangat tau uh, so it doesn't really look that much of a James Bond punya pair of sneakers uh, it looks pretty much like a normal uh, Adidas Ultra Boost sneaker just with a different colorway and also all these uh, extra designs based on the movie so yeah it's not really screaming James Bond uh, to my face lah uh, so I think most of you guys might like it most of you guys might not uh, but for me when it comes to collaborations I actually prefer for them to actually go the extra mile 
and make it look really much like uh, to have the James Bond theme in it. Because when we're talking about other companies, let's say uh, Reebok for example, you know when they do collaborations uh, like the Tom and Jerry collaborations, the Ghostbusters collaborations, you can actually see that they try to put a lot of the elements of the theme inside the shoe. And so for me, those designs lagi like, nampak menarik lah sebab uh, lagi sesuai for collection. So all in all, I think this is definitely something that you guys need to get if you guys are true fans of the film. No Time To Die was definitely one of the best movies of 2021 and I'm so glad that I got this. Alright guys, so that's all I can share with you guys for this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Kita jumpa lagi next video pula. Bye!